Hey guys, Martin here from Mattress Clarity. So finding the right comforter can really make or break your bedroom. Getting that perfect amount of fluff, that right sleep temperature can make for a sweet night of sleep. But if you're looking at comforters right now, there are so many options to choose from. And to help you narrow down your decision, I'm gonna talk about my five favorite down alternative comforters. I'm gonna talk about each one by one, who they're a good fit for, and why someone should pick a down alternative comforter. Let's get started. First off, if at any point you want more information about any of these comforters, just head over to mattressclarity.com. There you're gonna find some great reviews on bedding, mattresses, some great sleep research, and sleep news as well. But what is a down alternative comforter? Well, simply put, it is a comforter without down. Pretty simple, right? Well, basically with a down comforter, you have a fill with down, with feathers or some type of down. Down alternative is usually filled with something like a polyester fiber or some other type of synthetic fill. But why would someone want a down alternative comforter? Who should pick a down alternative comforter? Well, first off, those who are looking for something more affordable should definitely look at down alternative. In general, down alternative comforters are more affordable than down. Also, they are hypoallergenic. So with down comforters, some people struggle with watery eyes, a stuffy nose. You're not gonna have that issue with down alternative. Also, some people have an ethical issue with down. You don't have down and down alternative, so if you have an ethical problem with down and how it is harvested, you can definitely go for a down alternative. And then last but not least, if you want something easy to clean, down alternative is definitely the better option. With a down comfort, you have to take that to a dry cleaner or a laundromat. You can wash a down alternative at home in your own washer and dryer. But that's generally who should look for a down alternative comforter. But now I want to talk about my top picks, starting with the Superior Down Alternative Comforter. So I'm a big fan of the Superior because it has the benefits of down without the drawbacks. So in terms of benefits, it is very fluffy. And a lot of reasons people look for a down comforter is because of the nice fluff and the nice loft. You definitely get that with the Superior. It has a baffle box construction, which allows the fill to fully expand. And speaking of the fill, you get quite a bit of polyester fill. It's definitely a heavier down alternative comforter. At the same time though, it is quite breathable, so I was not overheating underneath this down alternative comforter. It's a good, versatile, all-season down alternative comforter. It also doesn't have the drawbacks of down comforters, so it is hypoallergenic. It is more affordable. Right now for the full queen size, $45, a very, very good deal. It's also very easy to keep clean and it's free of down. So if you're looking for something that's versatile, something with some nice loft, something that's warm but good for all seasons, I would definitely take a look at the Superior. Next up, we have the Utopia Down Alternative Comforter. Now, as I said, one of the main reasons people look for a down alternative comforter is because they're more affordable, and the Utopia is definitely that. Right now, for a queen size, it's only $30. That is a fantastic deal. But at the same time, it is a very high quality down alternative comforter. It has this brushed microfiber outer shell, a good amount of fill, some decent loft to it, and some nice piping around the edges. Now, I'm a big fan of the Utopia because it has duvet tabs on all four corners. That lets me tie this within a duvet cover and keep it nice and secure. This is a great option as a duvet insert. I personally use it for that reason in my own apartment. Overall, if you're looking for a nice duvet insert, you're looking for a quality down alternative comforter for not too high of a price, take a look at the Utopia. Then we have the Clima Balance. Now, a big issue people deal with with comforters is they make them sleep hot. They're less breathable, they trap heat, maybe people wake up in the middle of the night sweaty and clammy. But that shouldn't be an issue with the Clima Balance. That's because it's made specifically with hot sleepers in mind. And it has these squares called climate zones. They're basically holes in the comfort that allow for hot air to escape and keep you cooler at night. Also overall, it's kind of a thinner down alternative comforter, very breathable in every area of the comforter. So I personally was sleeping quite cool under the Clima Balance. It's also a nice quality down alternative comforter. So if you wanna sleep cool at night, definitely take a look at the Clima Balance. Next up, we have the Shea Moi Micro Mink Sherpa Down Alternative Comforter. Now, on one hand, I said the Clima Balance is a good fit for those hot sleepers, but what about those people who want something for those colder nights, those colder months? Well, they should definitely take a look at the Shea Moi. Looking at it looks more like a quilt, but don't worry, it is a down alternative comforter. On the inside, you have a fair amount of this down alternative fill, a polyester fill. 
Now what makes this stand out is the outer shell. It's actually flippable. So on one side you have a micro mink fabric, very smooth to the touch, more of that velvety feel. On the other side it's going to be a faux Sherpa wool-like material. Very, very bumpy but also very warm and cuddly. So whatever side you use, it definitely is going to keep you warm at night or if you want to sleep on the couch during the day and take a nap, it's really nice to snuggle up with. So I'm a big fan of this for those colder sleepers, those who need something for those colder nights and the colder months. Last up, we have the Buffy Comforter, a very popular down alternative comforter. This is my top eco-friendly pick. And that's because on the inside, instead of polyester, that fill is actually made from 100% recycled material. So very good for the environment. In the outside and the outer shell though, it's really nice. It has a eucalyptus fiber 300 thread count, very smooth to the touch, also has anti-inflammatory properties, so good for your skin, also feels really nice sleeping underneath it. I use it personally as a duvet insert, but works as a nice comforter in its own right. So if you want something nice and eco-friendly, something good for the environment, take a look at the Buffy. <music> Now I want to answer some frequently asked questions about down alternative comforters. First question is, what is a down alternative comforter? And simply put, it is a comforter without down. Pretty simple, right? Well, that's because on the inside, instead of down, it's going to have some type of fluffy fill made from the synthetic material, usually something like a polyester fill. Now, the second question is, what is the best down alternative comforter? Now, in my personal opinion, it is the superior down alternative comforter. It's a very good value, it's hypoallergenic, it has a nice amount of loft and warmth to it while still being breathable, a good all season down alternative comforter. The third question is, do down alternative comforters sleep hot? And in general, down alternative comforters are gonna sleep hotter than a down comforter. That being said, finding a down alternative comforter with a lighter fill, something with a more breathable outer shell, definitely isn't gonna sleep as hot as something with a heavier fill and a less breathable shell. And the last question is, is down alternative better than down? Well, it depends on what you're looking for. If you want something fluffier, something loftier, something with more of that kind of cloud-like experience, down is going to be a better pick. It's definitely better than down alternative in that respect. But if you struggle with allergies, you want something more affordable, you don't want something with down in it, you want something easier to wash and clean, then down alternative is better than down. In the end, if you're looking for a great down alternative comforter, one of these should definitely work for you. If you're still a little bit confused, you want a personal recommendation, just leave a comment below. Or if you want to read more about comforters, go to mattressclary.com. And we do a lot of videos just like this. So hit the like button and subscribe.